with Ninja right now and his very, <laughs> his very talented yet quiet friend Marshmallow. I would love a play-by-play -play of what just happened there. Yeah, so uh, me and Marshall rotated pretty early, which was what we wanted to do. We got into, on top of that mountain, took out a team, and then after that, uh, yeah, I mean, dude, all hell broke loose. We were in the best part of the map, so and that's actually got lucky. That's where the circle was, and uh, we had two teams come up from two different sides. Courage uh, was coming up with a grenade launcher, so I edited it out and killed him, and then uh, I just just two v one, and I just kind of choked on a on a ramp build, and you had 28 HP was one shot, but uh, hey, it's a warm up for a reason. So good understanding of how we want to rotate around the map, where we want to drop and stuff. So it's just about getting a circle, and I think this next game will be a really good game for us. I expect big plays from him yet again. The solo game, he was putting on a show. He's got to do it again. He has to. You know, I'm a little, a little uh, eyebrows. <laughs> Young man, you need to calm down. I would say I'm a, a little, I guess, disappointed. I was hoping to see Myth kind of shock us a, a bit more. Disappointed I'm in dis Myth? I know, you know. You're going to see this on Twitter. You realize I, that, right? He's, he's my boy. I love Don't him. Don't associate death. me with any memes <laughs> that are generated from this, please. please. He's my boy. I love I him to death. But you know what, man? He holds himself to a higher standard. And I think we're going to get it in this next game. Ever have. <laughs> There's Allier. There's Allier. But, Sniper Wolf, hello. And the players are getting ready. Smash up, there's King Richard right there. I expect big plays from him yet again. The solo game, he was putting on a show. He's got to do it again. He has to. You know, I'm a little, little uh, eyebrows. <laughs> Young man, you need to calm down. Nobody knows, but Loot Lake, Dusty Divot, and Anarchy Acres completely, uh, even Pleasant Park. Look at this north I'm, side. What I'm are you guys well, doing? I'm Go for some loot. I'm expecting Courage Joe to rotate Pleasant Park, but the fact that no one is there. That looks no like one went to Anarchy. Me. There's Tumbleweed just flying by. <laughs> <laughs> looks like we have the Tomato Man, to the Tat Man building up, trying to wall off against his opponents. Watch the fall damage, bud. He's going to build up, try and get that, the height advantage now. It's Tim versus Smith. Max down. One. Oh, oh. good night, Tim. Oh, you didn't know what you were up against, Tim. It's okay. We forgive you. We forgive you. But that is going to do it for Tim, the tap man, and his teammate. Now, Myth and Paul George, we you know, you spoke with them. Justine, I believe, spoke with them earlier. And I think they're just focusing up, getting ready. We also have another engagement that's going to be going on over here as well. A whole bunch of fall damage there. Oh, Kidstar, Kidstar. Kidstar. So Kidstar could bring home the W all. all on Ooh, that's going to be some fall damage. damage, as a matter of fact, that Kidstar ended up taking Courage. Oh, it's going right for it. Courage is right in his face. And it seems like Courage might be oh! oh! Eliminates Kinsar and takes out King. Sean. It's too bad. Courage it has been playing extremely well. Uh, Minus the fact that he sat a lot of time at Pleasant Park. Okay, I, I, I get it. Courage, you're a little scared. Well, it beats okay. Ninja and Marshmallow. They're on that. They're on that hill again. <laughs> in in myth-like fashion. Ninja's gonna have to channel his inner myth. Build high. Lots of fortification. Backpack hit. Loose fruit drops and beats in the uh, the base and salty springs. This is one of the new the newer structures. They're all the way down to the bottom. <laughs> and they're just partying, man. They just want to hang out. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> I think, I wonder if they think they're, oh, the, oh there you go. That was How are you going to cut away from that? <laughs> Backpack kid literally uh, doing the dance and you cut away. Unbelievable. Unafraid. I think but you might want to look out because Ninja's dropping some grenades in there, boys. Everyone just realized that you got to look at the giant metal tower that's in oh, yeah, the nice dude's spot. up there. Maybe we should do something Maybe about it. Maybe we should handle the business, but as a matter of fact, uh -oh. the nade launch comes through. Uh -oh. Courage throws down. He only has one. He <gasps> takes out Marshmallow. Oh, down. Courage takes on Marshmallow. Ten players back. left. Okay. Can you, can I, I'm going to build back up to you get bandages, okay? Terrible spot, and that is basically... Ooh, that is a small circle. It's not over yet, though, folks. Make some noise for Courage. See if you can bring it back. Let's go. Yeah, I mean, at this point now, if you're part of the Courageous, you, you got to believe. You have to believe. But he is Father, in such a bad oh. spot. <laughs> a look of pure fear. He's taking shots. Ninja. All he has to do is breathe on him, and he's going to get the win. Yeah. Yeah. Licked their wounds and, and waited for just the right time to come out. They played I, it so so intelligently there, Cassie. I, I need to. I mean, you have played with Ninja a lot. How do, how do you turn that around? You're, you're hiding. I'm pretty sure he hacks. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it was just tactical waiting. Okay, tactical, that's tactical waiting. waiting. Tactical Listen, waiting. Well, that's what Marshmallow did too. <laughs> Marshmallow did that as well. He just he sat there, he waited, and then he shot a guy in the back of the head. And he just supported his teammate, and then Ninja went in for it. But 
Courage also, he was in a really bad spot, but still though, what a performance, a fill-in here for, for the Pro-Am at the last minute, Uncle Jack doing the work, but it's this man right here, Ninja, and his partner Marshmallow, who get the victory. Let's actually send it over to Justine. I am here with our duos winner, Ninja and Marshmallow. Guys, congratulations. Thank you so much, this is amazing. Just super pumped. Oh my God. I mean, this came down to like the last second. And, yeah. and, and you know, what's incredible is watching you guys play here in real life. I mean, you guys are watching it online, but there's so much energy here in the stadium. Yeah, I can, you can just feel it. Like after every single fight, you hear one massive shotgun blast and the entire crowd is just freaking out, losing their minds because like just, it's just so intense. It's way more obviously epic uh, IRL than it is, you know, online. It's amazing. Right, uh, everyone, I, it just so much credit it needs to be given to uh, the, the celebrities who stepped up, right? You know, a lot of these guys, they, you know, they have very busy lives, but yet they still play Fortnite as much as they possibly can. And then they're out there, I even heard like a lot of them met, met up with their, and there's Ninja again, but a lot of them had met up and, and played online with their partner to get ready for this game. Everyone was taking this very, very seriously. Uh, yeah, uh, Ninja and Marshmallow, I think, training their whole lives for this moment. <laughs> Everything leading up to the, now, it, it, uh, on people's streams, on YouTube, videos and stuff like that of, of these people collaborating. And like I've said in the past, I'll say it again, Fortnite has has this ability to push its way out in, in such a good way and bring positivity. This is all for charity. Uh, and a number of, you know, a, a bunch of content creators have done charity events, Fortnite related in the past. It's all, it, it's Redway as well as Cyrus Spencer, 40 grand Patriota. Kyle and Drew, 50 grand. Gold, Gold Glove and Whit Lowry was able to get 60. Willie Rex, Prince Roy, 70K. You also had Ali A and Pete Wentz. Ali A went all the way, got three eliminations there, 80 grand for his charity. Then Stone Mountain, 64, and Jordan Fisher were able to get, uh, you know, some money for their charity as well. And then, you know, you guys know the rest. You read, you read the graphic. You know, you know who won the game. I commend Courage for securing the second place before, and we knew what we wanted to do, and we just stuck to it, and it worked out. Well, I think that's a good problem to have, and clearly it has worked out. But now we need to give you guys yes. the prizes here. We've got the Golden Pickaxes, Golden Boy, Dr. Lupo, and here you have it, guys, the 2018 Pro-Am Fortnite Tournament winners. Congratulations, guys. So much. So you were out fairly early, not the first, but you were the first to come over yeah, for no, an interview. Yeah, no, it was a gameplay thing. The thing is, I don't want to show off my skills yet. I want to wait for the duos. So I decided, let's let them think that I suck, and then I'm going to come real hard all over them. For sure. That's Crazy. a lot of information. Uh, so anyway, <laughs> moving on, uh, <laughs> strategies that you guys may have. <laughs> uh, you know, that's it. Mic drop right here. I think we might need to throw the mic at this point. Anyway, uh, this is all... Let's not all dance at once now. Do you guys like memes? This may be one of them. Players and to celebrate the community and competitive play, we're pumped to announce the 2019 Fortnite World Cup. We'll be supporting community run events, online events, and major competitions all over the world. Anyone can participate and anyone can win. You will have a chance to grab a Fortnite World Cup spot by competing in official qualifiers around the globe. The $100 million prize money will be split between many events at all different levels of competition. Fortnite World Cup will focus on solos and duos, but there will be plenty of opportunities for you to see many events at all different levels of competition. Fortnite World Cup will focus on solos and duos, but there will be plenty of opportunities for you to squad up in competition too. This is for you, the players. Qualifying for the Fortnite World Cup will be based on merit and Epic will not be selling teams or franchises and we won't allow third party leagues to do so either. Stay tuned because rules, player code of conduct and specifics about platforms and the initial schedule for fall 2018 are on the way. We can't wait to based on merit and Epic will not be selling teams or franchises and we won't allow third party leagues to do so either. Stay tuned because rules, player code of conduct and specifics about platforms and the initial Initial schedule for fall 2018 are on the way. We can't wait to see the Fortnite competition heat up. Thank you for joining us on this journey. Now everyone at the Pro-Am, back to you.